Hello everyone and welcome back once again to Worst Games Ever! It's the show, oh, the show where we play terrible video games sent in by you. My name is Peter. And my name is Ben. Hello Ben. Hello Peter, how are you? I'm alright, thank you. We've got two roles on this show, Ben, have we not? Yes, we have. I believe this week... Oh, <laughs> I'm going to let you go first because I feel like the victim always goes first and I was about to swoop in. That doesn't make sense. Whoa, steady. Uh, well, this week, I believe that I am the game's victim. Which means that I will be bringing the facts and bringing the terrible video game and I am the game's master. Perfect. What are we playing today, Ben? Well, Tiny Peter Austin, I thought it's time for a game where you can tru truly live your real life in video game form. Right. It's time for the Ant Bully. The Ant Bully. Oh, wow. The, uh, do you remember the Ant Bully, the yeah, film? Yeah, I love A Bug's Life. It's great. Yes. No, no, that was Ants. Right. Uh, yeah, but, sorry, that ants. was... No, you're thinking of small soldiers, aren't you? What? Oh, God. No, I don't know. I don't know what we're doing. Well, I don't know what this is. We better play it and find out what this actually is. Yeah, I suppose so. Womp. Womp. Wow, it's really checking, isn't it? It is. Oh, no, there we oh, go. Oh, what was that? Oh, oh. I don't know. I suppose we'll find out, won't we? Uses Bink Video, spelt with ones, mm -hmm. uh, by Rad yeah. Game Tools. Wow. Yeah, you know. Oh. Oh. Look at that. Is that an ant? That doesn't look like an ant. That's a little glow glow grub and a uh, What's carrying flying... it? Flying... I don't know what bug that is. No. Let us know in the comments. What bug is that? Midway. Do we have that bug here, do you think, in the in the UK? Maybe not. Maybe they are Americans, these ones. <laughs> yes. Oh, bunk. Oh, we're here. Mm. Boop, 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 boop. Got the little spirals and they're worshipping some it looks like the vault symbol Jesus, from Borderlands. Is, it's really loud for me. Hang it on. is, I've already I've already turned it down on my end. Uh that's fine, that's it, what they came. Oh! Oh! Oh wow, look at this game! It looks brilliant! Wait, what? <gasps> Why is the boy? Tiny. Oh, don't all get to it. It's you. It's me. You fight scorpions and... Okay, well, let's skip that. That's whatever spoilers. that was. I don't know, really. The Ant Bully is a video game based on the movie of the same name. It was released in 2006 alongside the theatrical release of the movie on PS2, GameCube, Game Boy Advance, Windows, and the Wii. The story and actions of the game correspond to that of the movie. It was developed by Artificial Mind and Movement, known for a number of licensed oh. tie-ins, many of which we've played here before. Hello? You can use your thumbstick on the credits. I made it go away again. It came up and oh, then... Oh, you just scrolled back. And scurried away. <laughs> just like an ant. Yeah. Uh, it was developed by Artificial Mind and Movement, known for a number of licensed tie-ins. We've played many of them on this show before. Uh, but they also are known for Naughty Bear and Dante's oh. Inferno. So it's quite a col quite a collection of games that they've made. It is. We've the, played uh, Naughty Bear. Oh. We Unfortunately, we have. The Ant Bully was published by Midway Games. Wow. That seemed like several facts. Thanks for all those. All in one. I've got one for you. Yeah. The reason I've not launched the game yet is because be a whip. There's no options menu. There isn't, is there? What's a B&M trailer? Is that? I don't know. At B&M, we've got everything you need for a spring clean. There's an E3 trailer as well. Look. E. Is it Ed, Ed and Eddie? Yes, it is. Yeah, it is. I recognise them. I remember a kid in my in my uh, in the playground at school talking about an episode of Ed, Ed and Eddie, and they were trying to describe what had happened in a scene, and they were like, "So then Ed with with one D said to Ed with two Ds." <laughs> I was like, "What the hell? Why are the two characters oh, called Ed? <laughs> this is ridiculous." I'd love to read some Ed, Ed and Eddie fanfic. It would be, <laughs> yeah. it would be incredible. Uh, anyway, we should probably play the game, shouldn't we? I we suppose. should. Yeah. What is that sort of? viscous membrane material that's stretched, stretched out between two ant legs. It's like the last human on um, Doctor Who with a face. Moisturise me. I don't like this this cursor 
bug either. It's a really no. weird one. <laughs> I wish I could give you its name. Yeah. I don't have it though. Right, let's see how much this is like A Bug's Life and Ants. I've not seen okay. Ants, so I wouldn't know. I've seen Ants. It's sort of... Oh, have you? Yeah, it's Bug's Life with PTSD, basically. Oh, it's kind really? of upsetting. It's got attitude. It's... Antitude. Yeah, I think so. I don't remember. Yes, I don't remember a great deal about it, but I think like ant limbs are ripped out at various oh, God. points. I think so. It's like Watership Down a little yeah, bit. Yeah, right. It's been a very long time. Bright eyes. <laughs> Rip out my arm legs. <laughs> Hello? Again, we witness another one of my finest <gasps> moments in battle. It's Bruce. This one is it's called... Bruce Campbell. It is Bruce. Is he going to teach us how to be Spider-Man? I'd love him to. He's going to grab a ham sandwich. Now, don't say I never did anything for you. Oh, too much mustard. Oh, they've got sort of a nice ghost effect going on. Oh, yeah, they have. Their, That's weird. The spirit is leaving their body a little is bit. Is that an emulator issue? I'm not sure. It must be. Probably. I do like how the Bruce Campbell ant has sort of a beard. They've managed to give him that. Yeah, an ant beard. He'll just look like a jerk. What is What is that? What is panning slip? Oh God, it's Freddy Krueger. <gasps> giant man. In order to know the true history of our colony... She's beautiful. Isn't she? She's the sexy ant. I like her eye makeup. That's how I know that right. um, I find her attractive, yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you, DreamWorks. Pixar and all the other studios for making a whole generation of children fall in love with animals. Giving boys and girls an eyeliner fetish for the rest of their lives. <laughs> yeah, what's that about? Is that where that came from? Yeah, maybe. Man. That Lucas Nickel had to live and work in the colony and learn our ways. That he must become an ant or he would never go home. Did he ever go home? What kind of ant did he become? Was he a forger or a scout? How can a human become an ant? Silence! S silence! So I was talking about eyeliner while they they glossed over the fact that a boy became an ant, but okay. Yeah, don't worry about that. Trying to help him find his place within the colony. Right, so... Oh, and now we're going to... We're going to do that now. So no cutscene of the boy becoming an ant, which I'm sure must actually happen in the film. Like, I'm sure yes. you, you probably see it happen. I have a synopsis of the first portion of the film, and it is absolutely bonkers. Right. So I'll read you that in a minute. This is not at all what I... Ex I thought the ant bully was just going to be the villain of the film. <laughs> and it was just... You would think that. Just going to be about ants, like, come, going up against a human boy. But no, you play as the ant bully. Quickly, Lucas, grab the pupas. Oh. And be sure to protect them. Grab the pupas. Grab the pupas, and then it immediately gets cut. They're eating the pupas, look. They are. And what if I don't care what happens to the colony? Then you will never become an ant. Is that? And you won't ever go home. All right, all right. I've got two things to say here. Yeah, go on. That that boy sounds like Mike TV from... Oh, he does a bit, doesn't he? The, the second version of Willy Wonka. Could be him. Okay. I don't know. I'll find, I'll find out for you right now, because I've still got the hyperlinks from the Wikipedia article I copied. Okay. And also, I mean... It's gone now, so you won't be able to hear it. But in that cutscene, the woman in particular, the sexy ant, she has some real mouth sounds going on as she was yeah, speaking. Yeah, she did. No, I heard that. I wasn't really sure how to bring that up. But yeah, yeah there's a lot of uh, mastication clicking noises, like it was recorded separately at home. Perhaps. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. While she was eating some taffy or something. Yes. That Lucas Nickel had to live and work in the colony and learn our ways. That he must become an ant or he would never go home. It's not Mike TV. It's not, okay. Try bringing four pupas. Oh, here's a pupa. Bring it. Oh, well, there it is. Lift. You can carefully loft it in. Right, so far, X does everything. So yes. I tried to jump immediately, and actually, it's a roll and a slightly weird one. <laughs> As well. Yeah, it's really fast. The jump is I've I played around in here just to test it. The jump it's um it's not one of the good ones there is from no video jump. games. Have I no, not found maybe I learned it later. Is, no, yeah, there is a jump. You'll find out and you'll be kind of annoyed by it. Okay. So. X is also lift. Yep. And put What's down. Yeet? So so okay. far, X is everything. Yeet is Is there a yeet circle? Button? Oh, there we go. I'm guessing I... Whoops. Oh, well, that's good, Throw isn't it? Throw it off the ledge. The, the, the roll button is the pickup button. Throw it off the ledge. Okay. Oh, no, I think you have to go get it. Oh. Because it's not for... Oh, look, now you got to... You just made more work for yourself. I have. He was just a little naked boy when he shrunk down. None of his clothes Oh, God, yeah, so they had to clothe with him. him. Oh, yeah. weird. But they don't wear clothes, so they... 
they sort of adapted and, and allowed for his... His own sensibilities. Yes, his human needs. Mm. His prudishness. There he is. Let's, let's try and get the camera against the wall. Everyone does have a little bit of a ghost, but it's very subtle. Just yes. a little ghost walking next to them. Hello, camera. Oh, oh no. Give me some. Give me that close-up of boy face. It, boy face. Give me that boy face. Oh. oh! Oh, that was really close. Now, can we do it? A little bit closer, son. Oh! Oh, he's, oh! oh, it doesn't like it, does it? No, nah, not really. It does not want you to do that. What's this? Oh. Fire crystals will be used to create a potion that will return you back to your human size. One out of a hundred? Oh. Oh my god. Okay, so why do we need to pick up the poopers? Let's just go get fire crystals. Yeah, let's do it. Can I sprint? Look at that radiant AI. Yeah. Can you see that? All of these ants have a day-night cycle. It reminds me of the B-movie game. There's one up there. How, so how do I jump? You'll see. It's not... Oh, of course it is. You'll see. You climb with up on the left stick and I'm guessing oh it's Harry Potter everyone. It's an auto jump. Oh, Nobody likes that. They don't. I like how it didn't auto jump when I walked off those ledges earlier. Oops. No. Jesus. Oh, oh you dropped oh, your oh. pooper. Oh no. I love that roll is also grab so when you get near something and prep oh, press X <laughs> yeah. it sometimes rolls instead. It's really good. Okay you want to hear what this game's about? Uh, yeah. Go pick on someone your own size. After okay. bullying an innocent ant colony, Oof. a young boy named Lucas is magically shrunk down to ant size and embarks on a remarkable adventure. Play as Lucas, experiencing the dangers and oh. thrilling life of an ant. <laughs> as you battle, explore, and forge new <sighs> friendships with natives and other species in this new ant world. Based on exciting moments from the upcoming digitally animated family adventure, The Ant Bully, and featuring all new challenges created especially for the game, which I'm assuming they tried to put in the film, but then realised you couldn't you couldn't undertake challenges when watching a film. <laughs> that doesn't make sense. I Help like Lucas. Oh, look at that ant over there, <gasps> really not sure where oh, to go. Oh, it just works. Deja vu, I have been in this ant hill before. <laughs> Oh, it doesn't. Give he doesn't little... jump there. He just barely makes it. Just falls with style. Yeah. Okay. Down you. No. Oh, he he climbs onto ledges when he oh, when you try and drop. I hate it. It's good. I also, as I said, have a synopsis of the first portion of the film's plot as lifted directly from Wikipedia, and it sounds like a wild ride. Look at these ants go. Where's where's that one? Oh. Lift. Oh, come off it. Oh yeah, because you're an ant, aren't you? So you can lift. Think. Where's that ant going? Trap it. No, it Oops, can just walk. Whoa. Oh, wow. So powerful. So strong. Impressive. I like that um, it's based on moments from the movie rather than, you know, just based on the movie of the same name. Based on no, moments from have that. the film. The upcoming film as well. This was one of my favourite moments from the film. I'm assuming you haven't seen The Ant Bully. I've not. I have not seen The Ant Bully either. No. Um, I'm sure there's some people watching this who have extremely fond memories of The Ant Bully. Mm -hmm. Ant Bully tattoos would die for The Ant Movie, are incensed the ant by movie. the fact that we Whoa. are covering the... the <laughs> 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 They're incensed that we're even covering The Ant Bully on this show. Oh, they faded out. How can a game of The Ant Bully possibly be bad? Yeah, here he is, the eponymous bully. This is where you get the gun, the ant gun. Mm-hmm. I love his ghost. Big fan of that. Yeah, it is nice, isn't it? It's like the subtlest emulator issue we've ever had. It's just, this isn't perfect. We're just, hello, I'm the emulator, and I want to remind you that this is not perfect, but it almost <laughs> is. You can see Lucas Nichols' uh, spirit. Spirit. The ghost not inside my child. The ghost yeah. adjacent to my child. <laughs> child adjacent. Yes. What's that? Oh, oh, it's this a little hint. Look out, you're gonna get rolled. Oh, what a weird amount of health for that to take off. <laughs> yeah. I want to know if I can walk up these these walls like an ant. Yeah. I bet later I can. I hope so. Maybe this is um, this is just the precursor to the to the Ant Man movie. Yeah. The Ant Man bully. Yes. The man bully. The the man baby. The Ant-Man bully is everyone else on the Avengers, I'm fairly sure. Yeah, that's true. And everyone who watches the Avengers. Oh, poor Ant-Man. We are all together the Ant-Man bully. <laughs> but we bully him out of love because it's Paul Rudd and how could you not love Paul Rudd? Yeah. Do I get to go home now? 
You heard no, you idiot. Did you not listen when they said a hundred crystals? By learning our ways, Lucas. And acquiring oh. Our oh, hello. Oh, that's not a good face. I'm a bit thrown by the the directions that their pupils are facing, you know? Mm. They're, they're all slightly off. Yeah. Sounds like a lot of work. You're right, it will be. So let's continue. <laughs> it's gonna be terrible. Let's go. Oh, the, the pretty ant just sort of touched him under his chin. If I was a boy, that would have... Would that be an awakening for you? That would have been it, yeah. Is this whole episode just gonna be about us fawning over an ant... An ant woman. ...from 2006? Yeah. 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 Who played the ant woman? Don't know. I'm looking. Julia Roberts in the film. Julia Roberts, really? I, I don't know about the game. I don't think I saw Julia Roberts in the in the credits. <laughs> we need to go back to the main menu to look. These ants are not very productive, are they? Look Can at I them. continue to be an ant bully in, in tiny form? Is that allowed? This isn't, this isn't the Phantom Menace game. You can't just kill Gungans for no. fun. No, yeah. Oh, that little rock just flew, or is it a seed? Seed? I don't know. Oh, what? They're, what are they? What's the goal what are they here, doing? guys? <laughs> oh, it's a warp room. There's Hover, catching puppers. <laughs> Bruce, unwanted guests. What you got? Come on, let's wipe out those pill bugs. Eliminating twenty of them should be enough to destroy them. Yeah, let's kill. Let's kill the pill bugs until they don't want to fight us anymore because they're sad because all of their <laughs> friends are dead. Look at him lifting weights there. What a, what a dude. I reckon that muscle mass goes straight onto his weird jaw. Mandibles. Mandibid. We're going upstairs. <gasps> upstairs. Uh, Fugax? There's only me. Yeah, yeah, right. So, Fugax. That's a good name. Everywhere. Lucas, we're on the brink. Isn't this exciting? Yeah. A pill bug's what we would call a woodlouse. Woodlouse, yeah. They look far more sinister in this game than they do in real life. They look like Matilda from Robot Wars. They do, yeah. Fugax. It throws me that their names are capitalised in-game, but yeah, then in subtitle weird. form, they're not. Let me try and get a nice... There he He's is. got no biceps. I don't know what he's flexing for. Players control the protagonist, Lucas Nickel, as he is shrunk to a miniature size and forced to work in an ant colony. He goes on many adventures throughout his backyard, from the Cactus Garden, which is a, a, a link that I can follow for some reason, <laughs> to okay. the Spider's Lair. Lucas must overcome the challenges and become an ant. Right. Ooh. I can I can do a powerful attack by charging my staff. Charging up your your staff. Oh, it's like Beyond Good and Evil. <laughs> Just like it. Oh. I was expecting that to destroy the rocks, but but no. Oh, it's too spiky. Too spiky. Can I go in this droplet? What is what is that? Oh. Oh, my goodness. Right. How do I have to move these? How? Let me... Hello. You press X to move them? No. Yes. Oh. But only oh. when it says you can. Let me do a charge attack. Oh, you can't even throw them at people. No. Rubbish. Rubbish. Whoa! Whoa! Incredible! Which studio or creative brainstorming session thought, hey, do you know what the world needs? Another animated ant film. I don't know. A third one. Yes. When was Bugs Life? I feel like Bugs Life was the 90s. Or Late 90, 99, maybe? So this mm. is like seven years removed. Like, time, time, enough time has passed. People love ants. They love movies about ants. Why does he judder like that when I hit something bad? It's weird, isn't it? <laughs> After yeah. overcoming many challenges, Lucas eventually has a, a mano a mano showdown, it says, <laughs> but doesn't say with who. Um, oh no, it does. Lucas first must shoot the exterminator's ear with the dart bow and avoid his hands and poison. Next, Lucas must blind the exterminator with the lava silk squirter. Ooh. Eventually, Lucas and the wasps drive the exterminator away after stinging him in the butt. Afterwards, Lucas collects the last of the fire crystals and returns to normal size. So that's the synopsis of, of the game on Wikipedia. So essentially, it sounds like all you do is fight the exterminator and there's other bits, maybe. Right. And you team up with the wasps to kill the exterminator. Sounds like it. Yeah. The enemy of my enemy, dot, dot, dot. Have I killed 26 of them now? Is that what? Yes, yeah, I 27. Have. I thought you only need to kill 20. Whoa! Well, you need to know how to swing that. Oh, he's, oh, talk he's talking. <laughs> it's great. Are you having fun? So much of it. Yeah, I, th I thought so. Yeah. It is fun. Would you now like to hear a synopsis of the opening section of the film? 
Yeah, just for, I mean, because I'm, what I'm really lacking here is the ant ant bully context. Yes, here we go. Film synops- and synopsis of opening section. In suburban Las Vegas, oh. lonely 10-year-old Lucas Nickel, played by Zach Tyler Eisen, is left with his older sister, Tiffany, played by Alison Mack, and his grandmother, Lily Tomlin, when his... Oh, goodness me. When his parents go to Puerto, Puerto Vallarta. Right. Neglected by his family and tormented by a local bully named Steve, played by Miles Jeffrey, who doesn't have a Wikipedia page, and his friends, Lucas takes out his frustration on an ant hill and attacks it with a squirt gun, terrifying the colony. One ant, an eccentric wizard named Zock, played of course by Nicolas Cage, tries to fight back. His girlfriend, his girl, the, this is the eccentric wizard played by Nicolas Cage. His girlfriend, a nurse ant named Hover, played by Julia Roberts, mm-hmm. who is fascinated by humans, attempts to communicate with Lucas. He drops his gun on the grass and kicks the anthill with one of his sneakers, sending the colony flying into the grass. Whoa. Hover tries to communicate to him, but she is almost crushed before being rescued by Zock. The leaders of the colony decide to use a potion Zock has recently created to shrink Lucas down to ant size. Brilliant. That's the premise. Good premise. I want to see it mainly <laughs> to witness Nicolas Cage as, a, as an ant wizard. Yeah, I'd love, I'd love that. Do you want to hear the ant wizard's detailed description of what we need to do here? Yes. Hopefully he'll say it again. This is meant to be Nick Cage. Clear the predator bugs. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> That's... That's sort of Nick Cage, isn't it? Clear the predator bugs. <laughs> Clear the predator bugs. If he doesn't start yelling about the not the bees, <laughs> the wasps when they the wasps, then they've missed an opportunity. They right? have, yeah, missed a huge opportunity. What do you think the Ant Bully film received on Metacritic? The film, I think. So on Metacritic, not not Rotten Tomatoes. Not Rotten Tomatoes. No. Okay. Um, based Are you going to actual... kill more stuff? Is that is that all yeah, you do in this game? So. Is collect think... babies and kill things? I can perform a role. I didn't actually listen to what I had to do there. I accidentally skipped it. So what is this mother here? That's a oh, caterpillar. Get off, off the thing. Sake. That's a caterpillar. Um, do I hit it? I'm going to Shadow hit of it. the Colossus now. No. Oh yeah, you got to keep the bugs off its legs. Clear the predator bugs. Oh, okay. Are we milking this thing? Is that... Why did it scream? Ah! Uh, I think it got fifty-five percent. Oh, very close. Fifty-nine oh, percent. Okay. Oh, the design of its face is really troubling. Makes me uncomfortable. Yeah. Look at it. Oh. It's so unhappy. It wants. It actually wants me to let these things kill it. Just let me die. Ah! Big fan of the ants just throwing grain around the place as though as though they're busy. They're like looking busy, you know? Yeah. Like, hey, watch out, Hover's here. Let's all pretend we've, we've got... all got to look cool. So, like, I don't understand why you're the only scout ant in existence. Why are, why are they all so terrible? Yeah. Like, this, this ant colony know. is doomed to fail, and quite frankly, it should be if they can't adequately defend themselves, that they need yeah. to shrink a, chi- a human child down. They're bloody lucky that they shrunk me, aren't they, really? Or they, otherwise, they'd be in big trouble. Absolutely. I love this Lego piece. A single Lego stud that this guy's carrying. Let me... Can I... It's, did you see it in the cutscene? It's scene? huge, yeah. yeah. I can't... Oh, it's, I can't the camera's away, not... It's not playing. No. I think these caterpillars are mooing. Oh, God. Are they biting its legs, or are they sort of drinking from its big caterpillar udders? I don't know. I do, are those udders, or are they legs? Or are they? they are, do, these are, are legs, the but I don't know what what a predator bug would get out of Ooh. biting a caterpillar's a caterpillar's leg. Yeah. What? What? How are they benefiting from this? I don't know. Oh, there's one in there. Really? In? Oh, it's on you now. Nine out of sixteen. Get off! Oh, there's a seed in the way. Who did this? Can I move it? Jesus. The, the ants are just running through it, like running yeah. directly through the side of the caterpillar. Con, you got this. Oh, so many predator bugs. <laughs> There's three left. One. Yeah. Two. Two. Ah. 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 ah! There he goes. Get him. Oh, her. Got it. Oh, an apple. An apple. Oh, wow, very kind of them to lift that up and move that up. Right, there's, there's no, no way, way an ant could lift an <laughs> Absolutely. apple, I'm sorry. 
No, this is this is the point where I draw the line. Yeah. It's unrealistic. I'll accept cow caterpillars and you know sinister wood lice, but stop. Rule of three, Peter. You got to do it again. Yeah. Video games. But now it's raining, just like in a bug's life. Yes. Now there's twenty to kill. Oh, fantastic. Does the water falling on you actually hurt? I, I don't think so. It's just sort of shoving me around a bit. <laughs> that's, that's helpful. Surely it should also be killing the predator bugs, but it's not. I didn't realize all this time that the that the bugs are showing up on the map. I've not even looked at it this entire time. I've just been going between the two caterpillars. Yeah, if there's a game that doesn't really need a mini map, yeah, it's actually this one. Peter, there's a speed run for this game. Of course there is. There's only one person who speed run it. Oh no, did I run out of time? I know, okay. That's Patrick Barrett. Patrick Barrett, okay. How fast did Patrick Barrett speed run the ant bully on PlayStation 2? I bet there's like not, there aren't so many shortcuts on this game. I think it probably took two hours. One hour, 51 minutes, Ooh. and 27 seconds. Very close. Wow. Yeah. It's the kind of game where you do just have to do everything, I think. Especially if there's 100 fire crystals to collect yeah. in order to finish the game. Oh, I wasn't listening. What You can now climb. To... It popped up in the corner. You can now climb. Oh, did it? Okay. How's this going to look? Oh, climb. there you go. X again. Up you go. This far, Lucas. Not only are ants strong, but we're also yeah, I'm great climbing climbers. like a real ant. Oh, You'll the be... lens flare. I'm climbing like a real ant. Oh, you got a timer. Oh. Six seconds for what? What was that? What, to, to do this? I don't Touch know. The thing? It disappeared. Maybe it was how long you could climb for. Why would they time me on that? What happens if I fail? You die. Press X to pick it up. Oh, oh now you can jump. One of the coolest things you can do is glide. Look for a flower pattern like this and press X to pick it up. Now jump. And then presumably I just run off the edge. Oh, oh, oh. he sort of fell a bit and then... Take that, Breath of the Wild. Yeah, here I You're go. You're not so special. The ant bully, ant bully, the ant, the ant bully. It's, oh, yeah. his face, <laughs> his eyes when he turned around. Yeah. Uh, the ant bully's been doing this shiz since 2006. You're not so special. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Who do you think you are? Nothing. You're nothing. Running around leaving scars. Oh, I see. This oh. is also like Breath of the Wild. Like once it ticks down. Just like Breath of the Wild. This is just like Breath of the Wild. Oh. <laughs> Well, you're invincible, yeah. so it's fine. What is the Metacritic average for the Ant Bully? Um, let's say some people thought it was okay, and therefore mm. the average is 60%. Ooh. Oh, Ooh, it's 52. Okay. 52% okay. on Metacritic. Pretty much bang average. <laughs> bang in the middle. Yeah. The highest review came from Game Daily, who said a cute and fun title, perfect for young gamers and fun for parents, too. Oh. What did they give it out of a hundred? Um sounds pretty positive. I think seventy three percent. Eighty percent. Oh no, that's way too much. Seventy three is way too this much. This game but... is excellent. 80%. Oh. <laughs> the lowest score was actually there was a tie, a tie between Games Radar and Gamezilla. Gamezilla said, It's simply another in a long line of cookie cookie cutter games that won't really add anything to your collection. It is. And Games Radar said, The Ant Bully isn't wholly shameless about setting the bar low, and kids are bound to get at least a little joy from its small world, but this colony is just too repetitive and dull to be fun for long. It is very repetitive. Um, what did they give it out of a hundred? Thirty-five. Forty. Forty. Forty percent. And there we are. Those are all my facts. It really is just a bit, just a bit rubbish, isn't it? It's just a bit nothing. It's yeah. Like it's not terrible. It's inoffensive. Yeah. It's bland. Very. From a bland movie. It's beige. To a bland oh. game. Oh, I got Zelded. Right. Well, that's. Flip that. That's enough. If I'd climbed up there, I would have carried on for a few minutes, but because I fell, we are done. It's like Ninja Bread Man and B-Movie. Well, thank you everyone for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Let us know in the comments below if you were attracted to either the Lady Ant or Bruce Campbell's bearded ant in this, yes. uh, in this game. In the Ant Bully. Uh, in the Ant Bully. Both um, very, very attractive, beautiful people. They are. Can I swim? Ants can't swim. I know, Ants, and you are...
are no ant. Wow, that's a cruel thing to say as he dies. Yeah. Uh, brilliant. Thanks, everyone. Uh, remember to sh uh, support this video and series by sharing this on the Ant Bully subreddit. I'm sure yes. that's a very active one. Yes, um, absolutely. And the eye makeup subreddit. I'm sure there's one. Oh, yeah. Yeah. See what people think. See if they think she's on fleek. As they say. Is that it? Is that how you use that one? On flick. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. Brilliant. What a great joke. Thanks. Okay, well, we'll leave it there. Bye, everyone. Bye, everyone.